Hey guys, today marks the end of 30 years of me bitching about something. Um, on these old Toyotas, since I got the dash part and doing a lot of stuff right now, on the old Toyotas, Toyotas, 86, in one year they had a little oh, key release button up here. When you start the car, you know, you have to go out here and uh, press a button. Well, I got tired of it. So I went ahead and see here. There we go. We went ahead and put a clamp on it and epoxied the button down. There's really no reason not to do this on this car. I'm sorry for waiting. There's no reason not to do this on this vehicle. Um, I just went ahead and got some cheap Harbor Freight uh, two-part epoxy. I put it on there and clamped it down with a big clamp. And um, there we go. Now we can take the key in and out. Now, it's not really a problem to use your finger to press it down as you pull your key out, but for so long, I work, I've been working on the dash or working outside or working on the engine, and I have to come in here and I get in all these weird positions just to pull my key out. Well, no more. Once I put the cover back on, let's say that's more wiring, dude. Once I put the cover back on, it'll all be done and fine, and there'll be no more problems with that key. So, And if I ever have to break it free, I can just grab a pair of ice cream or something and break it free and twist it and it'll break the epoxy or I could cut it out or chisel it or whatever but I see no reason to ever put it back now you could just as easily insert the key and then take the pin there and uh, pop it out uh, there's a little metal lever down inside there that locks well I'm not going to bother with that this is such an easier solution without having to pull a cylinder so that's a quick tip um, just, just there's no reason not to do this in lieu of pulling it apart so i'm just tired of it and it's just a pet peeve but on these old toyotas and i don't know about other cars but on an 86 toyota pickup with uh sr5 body on it this this will work just fine all right have a good one